What's up guys? It is Thursday. Almost done with my vacation, but let's not think about that right now. Anyway, yesterday I started to clean up the back area. As you can see over here, my patio pavers right in this area were really sunk in. So whenever it would rain, I'd get a puddle there. So I dug them out. I added more soil. I got it as level as possible. And then I started to lay sod. So right now, as you see there, I got about 14 pieces of sod laid. So all I'm going to do now is just, I went and got 20 more pieces, so I'm going to keep extending it out. I'm just scraping back all the top leaves and debris, putting them in the banana patch. And then I'm adding a little bit of the chicken compost and some organic fertilizer. And then I'm laying the sod right down. So let's get to it. I gotta say guys, this is how the whole backyard looks. All the leaf litter, the chickens have been running the backyard for about a year straight. And I tell you, the one good thing about that is this, now that I'm putting this sod down, look at how much I got done already. It is so nice and tilled up. All of this is just beautiful soil. It's beautiful, so easy to work with. They've been tilling it, they've been fertilizing it forever, so really helped out. Thanks a lot, chickens. It's a hard job, but you're making it easier on me by not having to dig into hard, compact soil. It's beautiful to work with. This is awesome. Anyway, back to work. I've been needing to do this for a while, so I'm really glad it's finally started. Alright guys, so that's what 40 pieces of sod looks like. I still got a little ways to go. We're going to keep leveling it. We're going to keep moving backwards all the way over by the logs by the chicken fence. Get that all sodded in. It's going to look really nice. Now I'm going to go trim some of the bamboo forest because it is taken away from some of the light that could be getting in here. So let's go over to the bamboo forest. Okay, the one thing about this bamboo is it is creeper, so it will run and just pop up in different areas. So I just want to keep it a little more contained. What we're going to do is we're going to keep these pieces of bamboo and then we can use them out in the garden for bamboo sticks that I go buy at Lowe's, right? I'll make my own. I'm kind of mad that I just went and bought a whole bag of these bamboo sticks. Well, I guess now I'll just sit here, drink a beer, and 
and start processing them. Probably could just leave that on there, I guess. Alright guys, so check it out. Harvested all this bamboo just now. I got tall ones. I got little ones like this for like little plants, indoor house plants, whatever. It's pretty cool. Cleaned them all up. Now we'll just kind of leave them out, let them dry. their bamboo stakes ready to use in the garden right from the backyard. That was fun. That was pretty cool. Now I'll just let them grow again. Maybe next year I'll do it again. Anyway, bamboo stakes. All right guys, so there you go. Just another vacation video. It's Thursday today, so I got three more days off and back to the grind. But anyway, today did a lot of good work. About 40 of these of sod. It is about to be springtime. A lot of people are gonna be planting sod. The way I did it, first of all, my chickens were in here in the backyard just digging up and pooping naturally. So they basically tilled the whole backyard for me. All I had to do was level it, put a little bit of organic fertilizer down, some of the black cow manure, laid it down, called it good. So water it in real good. I'm sure it'll be fine. Molly sure does like the grass as long as she doesn't dig it up. I'm talking to you, don't go hide. Oh, are you going to look for lizards? Any lizards? You see any lizards? Get them, Molly. Get them. <laughs>